So hello guys, this is the Amanda P5 here once again, back at you with a quick little video because I just got asked, uh, you know, from somebody to what my actual settings are which I use in Battlefield Play for free. And since I have not really made a video about this, I figured I'd make a quick little video showing you guys my sensitivity and my um, actual settings in Play for free. Now I do not want to make this a very lengthy video so I will just quickly go over everything. Now here you can see my hotbar which I use. For my guns I use it at a 1 and 2 because it's something that I found convenient and especially for my pistol and my you know second primary which I'll get into in a second I like the setup quite a lot. Now for my third I use my grenade which is something I've just grown accustomed to because it's really easy, easy to reach but there's nothing stellar about this. The you know first gadget which I use mostly sometimes I have my ammo box here as well and my um, medic box along with the tracer dart for both the recon and the engineering class. It's something that I have to get to really quickly and use very often and it's of course bound to my mouse button. Now this is a side button on my gaming mouse. If you do not have this, I strongly recommend setting this to something which you can reach reach very quickly. Something like the button V or C on your keyboard would work wonders. So just experiment and see what you like. Now over here I have one of the most important ones which is my knife. It's something that you want to reach very quickly especially if you are in a high pressure situation where you have to press it really quickly. Of course, I have this bound to my mouse button as well, and I recommend you guys bound it to a mouse button as well. If you do not have a mouse button, what you can actually do is bind it to your middle mouse button. So if you click your middle mouse, you will, you know, use your knife. Or if you do not use any ballistic range ace, um, what you can do is bind this to scroll up or scroll down, which you can use very quickly if you're in a panic situation. Now over here I have something which doesn't really matter quite often, but um, I do have this bound to my middle mouse button, my motion sensor, but uh, what matters more is uh, that I have the same button bound to my RPG as well. So I can quickly switch to my tracer dart from here and then click my middle mouse button to switch to my, tra to my RPG, sorry. Which makes it really easy and quick because you do not have to find buttons on your keyboard. And I really recommend setting these buttons to your mouse, you know, if possible. Now, G, I have set this because it's very easy to reach, but I do not have to reach it quite as often because you only have to press it once. So uh, that's why I set this to G. But well, I might as well could have set this to something like five or six. Doesn't really matter that often. Now, V is my, you know, one of my most used, you know, buttons. I use this quite often because a lot of times I like to run dual weapon boosters. And I would have my second primary as my V button because I just find that it is very easy to switch between weapons if I have it like that. Now over here, V and a V and caps lock. I have set this most of the time to my adrenaline shots because I find I can re I can reach this button very easily while mid battle uh, because I have to reach this very quickly if you want to stay alive for a lot for longer periods of time. But um, you can experiment with this. You can even bind this to your mouse button. Or anything like that but I just recommend having this set to something which you can reach very quickly like I have done so now I will quickly show you guys my sensitivity so if you want to copy my exact sensitivity settings you can do that if you wish now if you want to copy my exact sensi sensitivity settings I use a DPI of 800 as you can see right here if I can bring this up I use a DPI of 800 as you can see right here uh, and with a sensitivity if you want to copy that as well if you want to go to my computer open documents and then open Battlefield play for free and then controls now if you want my exact settings copy these over to your control settings and then save your actual file now remember to make a backup of your own of your own file so if you do not like my settings you can actually revert back to your old settings as well this uh, these are all my sensitivity settings this is what it looks for my helicopter and jet settings as well. And if you would go in actual game, you can see right here. I have my helicopter settings all the way to max uh, with an inverted mouse set to no. And my plane, my sensitivity is almost at the max along with my pitch factor. And I have my yaw factor in the middle of these two. 
And I hope this, you know, clarifi clarified some things for you guys. I uh, hope it, you know, answered all your questions. If you got any more questions, feel free to ask uh, about why I use certain things. But for now, guys, this has been the man of and I'm out. We can't stop, failure is not an option Learn from our mistakes, we adapted as a doctrine Locked and reloaded and blood sweat devoted Thought that they could keep us down, we would stay demoted But nah, from the ashes we rose And dreams manifest through the actions we chose On time to slack, I tip my hat to he who actually knows If you're playing picture perfect, then you have to repose You can't harm my army, I ain't through recruiting A bit of Malcolm X with a splash and you be Newton Perseverance be the answer like the shoes I hoop in we won't rest until the day we get restitution They thought they let us fall by the wayside But we gon' fight into the building, face side Got an aspiration, they healing these lacerations Fascinations with fabrication, so tell me as a nation Who you gon' call when you're back against the wall And you got no time to start